Hey there, gorgeous. My name is Dusty, and this is the Scorpio Priestess. If you like my vibe, I would appreciate your likes and your subscribes. If you would like a personal reading, you can do that by visiting ScorpioPriestess.com. It is in the description of this video, as well as the link in the bio. I do have a snoring puppy in the background, so please excuse her as she has a soft palate that hangs on her vocal cords and it makes her so loud. It cracks me up, but it can be annoying. Libra, we are reading for the next two weeks of your life. We have the candy and the apple. You may like candy apples, but there is somebody that is eye candy or they look at you like that. This person is tempting and they want you to take a bite out of the apple. There could have been something that was really tempting, an offer that was tempting that you are going round in your mind about. The letter M, R, P, and the letter B. Now this could be your first, your middle, your last. The person on your mind, the person coming towards you. Spirit, tell me who is coming towards you? Libra from now until the 29th. Who is coming towards them, please? A secret admirer. Okay, Libra. I'm telling you, you got somebody here that looks at you like you are eye candy. This is somebody that you have unfinished business with, or at least they think that they could have um, put you up on the side and you know your worth, so you have said no. Although the offer may be tempting, a lot of you are going to say, no. You could have an unexpected love interest coming in. Somebody new for some of you that is very attractive. This person feels like they are your weakness or, you, you know, you are theirs. They're head over heels in love. They feel like a kid when they're around you. You make them feel so good. A blast from the past, nostalgia past, past events. This person definitely could be coming on back in, looking at your pictures, looking at a, an old video you sent, listening to an old voicemail I'm hearing. You're going through a glow up. There's been major self-improvement. You're really working on yourself, standing in your power, emerging stronger working from your light side, working from, from the light. Maybe for a while you were in dark energy. We all have light and we all have dark. Everybody has a shadow self. When you met this person, you could have uh, maybe been put into some toxic place where you didn't act at your best and now you are glowing up. You're looking good. You're feeling good. And there's some, tell me about the unexpected love interest. You may not even expect this. This person could come in out of the blue. Some of you have legal issues with this person. You actually have a court case with them and they're moving in silence. They're haunted by you. Memories, flashback, trauma, side effects, this person. They are haunted by your love. This is somebody that you feel like is just moved on with their life or that you haven't heard from in a while. If you work in law enforcement, you could possibly um, meet somebody else that works in law enforcement. It may not be anybody you even know. This could be somebody new. You could have dark skin. They could have light skin, vice versa. Somebody here could have really curly hair, very long curly hair. Oh boy, this person's reputation isn't good and they're watching you from fake accounts. You may want to watch the Gemini reading, especially if you're dealing with a Gemini. They may want to force their way back in, not take no for an answer because this person is haunted by your love. Whatever happened here, they, they can't stop thinking about it. They most likely did you dirty and the divine is beating them down with bad karma. They're creeping around. They're obsessive. They could be dealing with an obsessive karmic lover. Somebody that's very possessive, dangerous, and toxic. An unhealthy, possessive karmic. Tell me about this. That could be who is watching you, really. Oh boy, a lot of conflict, competition. If you're dealing with someone who has children to someone else, 
who, um, you know, co-parents or went back to a baby mom, Libra. This person is watching you. They have a really bad temper. Some of you are dealing with a person, a karmic yourself, that's really toxic. There's always disagreements, ego, strife. You're coming out in the energy strong here, really sitting on your throne, standing in your power. You could have gotten a new job. You've definitely went through an ending. These people could be watching you online. I got this this like feeling of nervousness around this energy in my third eye i'm seeing something like i would be careful of keyed cars or i, I don't know what i'm seeing um keying a car perhaps or or writing really me angry an angry writing or something like this Tell me what they want. Some of you have a toxic karmic that will not leave you alone, that are, is creeping. There's illusion, there's fear, there's past, condi past conditioning. You may get some kind of news from this person. Some of you had to have someone arrested. Um, others, this person is dealing with this karmic that's attached to you. And there's been a lot of conflict, a lot of competition. You seem to be trying to move on, making judgment calls slowly, but surely you are. They could be stuck with some third party here that's moving in silence and watching you on fake accounts. The final reckoning is what I'm hearing. There could be a final showdown. Some of you are with someone who has a baby mom or dad or something like this that's very toxic and very low vibrational. They're obsessive. They're always making things hard. They're, they're always trying to, to play games. You will get your justice. You're coming up very strong in the energy. You know what you want. You know who you are. And you're not, you haven't came to play. There, there could be a court case that you're going to in the next few weeks. God, I hope you don't have to have somebody arrested. There's somebody that could work in law enforcement for sure. A lot of, um, lot of things about the justice system here. You have integrity and you've learned a lot of life, life lessons. And I'll tell you what, your good karma is going to be um, denying this person. Aquarius, you could be dealing with an Aquarius. They're very impulsive, very flighty. This was definitely destiny. You're realizing some truths here. Pushing forward, they, they, they could want to break barriers. You were destined to meet. You have a strong bond, a lot of passion, a deep inner knowing that this is a divine connection. There are so many barriers stopping us from being together. I am trying to be my best self and become a better person so I can knock down the walls for you and eventually be with you. You know, Aquarius got something about walls, uh, and, and you may want to look at, if you're dealing with an Aquarius, they got something about a fence or a, a wall around their heart. They may be trying to break barriers so they can come in and do right by you. They've got to let go of this toxic karmic because this person's becoming obsessive. I would be careful. I don't know what's going on here a hundred percent. They could be a Sagittarius to another Libra, a fixed sign. Something could happen by the end of Pisces season if it doesn't happen in the next two weeks by the 20th of March. What is the spiritual message for Libra? Just know that there's somebody secretly admiring you, watching you, wanting to come back, looking at past pictures and text messages, etc. Survival communication joyful chapter and momentum keep up the momentum whether a big or small steps keep pushing forward you know there's somebody i'll tell you something's about to happen here quite fast it's gaining momentum but you're you're entering into a very joyful chapter it is your good karma 
take pride in your accomplishments and celebrate the joy of your life, happiness, fulfillment, and joy. Time to reset your mind and thrive. Let go of old coping mechanisms that are keeping you at status quo. Be open to receive messages right now. It's important for you to communicate clearly. You're about to receive a call or a text. The divine is asking you to, to communicate clearly. Say what's on your mind to this person. Let them know exactly how you feel. It looks to me like a lot of you can't wait to have the opportunity to do that. What is the angel number download that we can give them? What is the angel number that they should expect to see, Spirit? Angel number 111, intuition, joy, clarity, self-realization. Time to implement long-cherished ideas. You're on the right track towards making your dreams and visions a reality. The right people and circumstances and resources are being sent your way. Happiness and new opportunities are at hand. Trust the process. Trust the process, Libra. You're almost there. There's a lot of great opportunities coming in. Patience. There's some destined things coming. You could have new money, new prosperity on the way. Something really good. This is your good karma for dealing with this mess. I hope you have the best two weeks ever, and I will see you again soon. Love and light.